Hello everybody, my name is Nathan Sifu, and welcome to Mass Effect 2. Let's play. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad that mission done. I'm so glad I finally beat that. I've gone through this game so many times, and I've... I mean, I usually have trouble with this mission, but usually not that much. It's my, it's my first time going through as a vanguard, so maybe that has something to do with it, but... Yeah. Jack is big. Yeah, Jack Jack was looking pretty good in, in Mass Effect 3. Just that little bit of hair on top of her head makes makes a difference. Makes a difference. Yeah, her character does grow on me eventually. Welcome to the Normandy, Jack. I'm Miranda, Shepard's second in command. On this ship, we follow orders. Tell the Cerberus cheerleader <sighs> to back off, Shepard. I'm here because of our deal. Uh, go ahead, give her the files. Miranda will let you into the system. Let me know what you find. Hear that, precious? We're going to be friends. You, me, and every embarrassing little secret. I'll be reading down in the hold, or somewhere near the bottom. I don't like a lot of through traffic. Keep your people off me. Better that way. <laughs> What's that? Well, she she was one of my bays. <laughs> the hair she added was everything. Oh, yeah, the um, yeah, and actually wearing clothing. Um, yeah, I find that um, despite her lack of clothing, I actually find her not um, all that appealing in this game. Um, okay, let's talk to the crew. Yeah. Um, Nathan, how many times have you played through this? Oh, uh, let's see. Through, let's see, through Mass Effect 1, I've done that about four times. This would be my seventh for Mass Effect 2. Mass Effect 3, when I get to it after this playthrough of Mass Effect 2, once I get to Mass Effect 3 again, that will be my fourth or fifth. I can't remember. Yeah, this is definitely the one I've played through the most. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Not now. Working on collector data. Have ruled out artificially intelligent virus. Unless it's very intelligent. And toying with me. Hmm. Tests. Anything else? <laughs> I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Even when Morton has nothing to say, what he the things he says are great. Oh. Hop grades. Do I have any more hop grades? Let me do some shotgun damage. Well, damn, seven times, true fan. Oh, yeah. Um... You assume two is my favorite. Um, honestly, it is. Uh, it's a hard. Ch I can't decide whether two or three is my favorite. It's. I can't decide. Yeah, it's. Um, okay. Oh, good. I got the shotgun damage. Um, I mean, in case you're wondering, yes, I was absolutely bitter the first time I beat Mass Effect three. But uh, I felt, anyway, even though some people don't agree with me, I did feel that the extended cut did fix most of the issues that I had. I, I was able to fall in love with the series again. Uh, prototypes? Nah, I don't need any prototypes. Ship enhancements? Oh yeah, the med bay. Okay, never mind. Alright, good. I got upgrades. Oh, and let's save the shit out of this. Hello, Kelly. Jack's tattoos are beautiful. As colorful as her past, I'm sure. I have concerns with her temper, though. Uh... <laughs> what do I mean? Why would I ask that? Of course I know what she means. Yeah, she's nuts. I'll do my best not to piss her off. Please warn me if you fail. I want a chance to hide. Anyway, what's up? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? Uh, no, that'll be good. That'll be all. I'll be. Oh, <laughs> cut her off. <laughs> uh, what's that? I got you. By the time I played MP3, the extended cut was already out, so that's the only version I know. It, um, I wasn't. It wasn't the best ending, though. But uh, it was all right. Good evening. Hello, deep boys. Good evening. Uh, for me, the whole game is one big ending. Wraps up all the story ends. Yeah, it kind of is. It kind of is, and I mean, given this, given what 
this series is, like, how do you no, make Hamlet, an ending for that? How are you going to spend your next furlough? You really think we'll have another shore leave? Of course. Shepard's forming the best team this galaxy has ever seen. We're or Sam. And ass. I'm sure you're right, Matthews. Or Sam. We're, we're going to go to the Citadel and get fucking smashed. <laughs> They're Joker. Okay, Shepard. Glad you're back. But keep an eye on that last one. We can only hold so much crazy. I assume everything is going well up here. Shh, 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 shh. Joker? I can tell when it's listening. I am always listening, Mr. Moreau. I know. <laughs> That's it for now. See you, Commander. What was I going to say? But yeah, the... Um... Yeah, the extended cut ending, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with. The original ending, ooh, I, I almost, I almost quit video games. As like, I'm almost quit all video games when I saw the original endings. Good God, it, it hurt me. <laughs> Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Already. I'm not big on forcing these talks, Shepard. Let's do this later. Fine. Asshole. <laughs> we'll talk later. Commander. Mm. Oh, um... I was gonna say... Oh yeah, since I've got so many new people in the stream right now, um, I just thought I'd mention... Uh, the reason why I don't stream with face cam is because my computer sucks. It sucks pretty hard. It This, this is kind of the max capability, unfortunately. Um... Uh, what was gonna say um, about sucky no, computer? Oh yeah, um, I am. I do actually have a camera on me right now, recording. And when this goes on to YouTube as a let's play, I add the the face cam on there afterwards. But uh, <laughs> I'm too busy looking at the stream. I'm not at the, not paying attention to what I'm doing. Where's the, the elevator? That's what I need to do. What was it? It hurts when you love us. Uh, a series so much and it ends in a subpar way looking at you MGS5 yeah that's what I heard I'm actually going through I'm actually going through Metal Gear Solid 5 right now and um what I was gonna say the the, end, the the opening blew me away but now I'm finding that it seems like the game's just bloated with a bunch of these these piddly little side missions it's like Metal Gear doesn't need to be open world it needs to be, you know, somewhat linear. You have lots of options from getting to A to B. But, you know, more story elements. You know, ugh. You know, it's... I'm getting through it, and I mean, I do have fun with it, but it's a little bit of a chore, you know? What's it? Uh, it that's all good. We do podcasts once a week with uh, games, uh, but our other streams are cameraless. Oh, okay. Yeah. Commander... I very much enjoyed sharing that ice brandy with you. But I hope I wasn't too unprofessional. Brandy goes straight to my head. Yeah, you, you don't remember, but you were totally hitting on me. I, I mean, what? Uh, yeah, yeah, it was good. It's nice to see you let your hair down. Guess I hadn't realized how much those feelings needed airing. But I didn't give you much of a chance to vent. So tell me now. What do you think? Um, I, I'm thinking that you're uh, looking pretty taut for your age. I mean, uh, uh, I want revenge. The Collectors destroyed our ship and killed our crew. They're gonna pay. Then I have a feeling their days are numbered. Oh. You don't have many enemies. Oh, shit. Live oh. ones, that is. Well, promise me <gasps> we'll share a bottle every year. The oh, God, don't break. On me. Oh, God, the game. What's happening? Holy shit, it almost broke. Did you, did you see that, guys? <laughs> hmm. Was it? Yeah, MGS Five story is told through tapes. It felt uh, lazy. Yeah, I think so too. Um, but I think Kojima took the cutscene criticism to heart. Yeah, he should not have listened to that. I loved the cutscene. The cutscenes like MG, uh, Metal Gear Solid Four's cutscenes. Like the ending was like, I think it was like an hour and Thank forty you, minutes long, Rupert and I loved it. I loved every second of it. You know. How can I help you, Commander? Uh, need anything? You have everything you need. Absolutely. Since you set up my kitchen with proper supplies, thanks again. I won't take any more of your time. Back to work. 
<laughs> the Reapers are trying to break the game. Does anybody else think that this guy looks a little bit, just a little bit like the bald guy on Shark Tank? How can I help you, Commander? I won't take any more of your time. Back to work. I think he kind of does. What was it, Hasroom? Good call hosting this dude, Nathan Seafood. Oh, thank you so much, guys. Wow. Wow, I have an audience. This is awesome. Shepard, need me for something? Yeah, I'm usually... Uh, I usually have, like, one or two, maybe three people in the stream. So, so, so having this many is, is, like, a lot. So this... This is great. Uh, I just wanted to talk. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. <laughs> in the middle of calibrations. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Oh, Garrus, you, you and your calibrations. Me loves it. Yeah. <laughs> Commander, what can I do for you? You have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. All right. Of course, Commander. I'm from the Ministry of Derpy Walks. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, wait a minute. Who, have, who haven't I talked to? Oh my God, I haven't talked to the the the, the, the guys in the basement yet on this playthrough. I haven't talked to the Scottish guy yet. Holy shit, how did I forget about that? Garris must be pretty bad at his job if he's calibration things that much. Uh, yeah, man, glad we came by. Uh, we'd love to have you come through our chat, hang with the uh, BGB fan, uh, if you're up right. Uh, yeah, yeah, just... Um, um, so how, how would I do that? What, I guess I guess I would just follow uh, BG, uh, the BGB and then um, and then I'll get notified when you go live. Uh, was it? Uh, well, he started calibrating tally. If you're not romancing here, oh, I'm so t calibrated. I'm I'm gonna be doing my own calibrations on tally. You know what I'm saying? Tally, Tally's got oh. Tally's got them hips, and I, I am not let I am not letting them go this time. You came all the way down here to see us. You're speaking to our commanding officer. I'm touring the ship, getting to know my crew. I'm Engineer Ken Donnelly, handling the power control systems. This is Gabby. That's Engineer Gabriella Daniels, actually. I'm responsible for the propulsion systems. What can we do for you, Commander? Uh, need anything? Are you set up okay down here? We can't complain. I just wish it didn't take so long to calibrate the FBA arrays. The Kenneth, you're complaining. <laughs> I love a Scottish accent. <laughs> what kind of problems are you having? When they upgraded the Normandy design, they got a bit sloppy with the FBA couplings. I won't bore you with the tech, but there's an array of attenuators in the primary power transfer system that channels the field bleed. Kenneth, you're boring <laughs> the commander with tech. In short, if we had T6 FBA couplings installed, it'd save us a lot of maintenance time each day. Uh, you don't have them? Why isn't something like that already installed? It's probably just a design oversight. Efficiency isn't affected. It's a maintenance issue. Also, the T6 model can be hard to find. Nash and Stellar Dynamics discontinued them. We could probably find used ones in the Omega markets, but we have no time for shore leave. Oh, I'll, I'll get it. I'll get it for you guys. Oh, oh wait a minute. <laughs> Excuse me. Well, Tally's hips don't lie, yeah. <laughs> uh, was it, you can follow us on Twitch. Uh, we're also on Twitter if you're on there. And uh, we have a, a Discord chat room where we all ha hang out really. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I'll definitely... Um, yeah, I'll, def I'll definitely... Um, I, I'll, once uh, once I'm done streaming, I'll, I'll look up your, your Twitch uh, channel there and I'll, I'll, I'll follow you for sure. I won't ask him all about about these things. Oh wait, actually, yes, I will. Actually, yeah, I will talk Where to these you guys. Receive your training. Both Gabby and I started in the Alliance, serving on the SSV Perugia. She flew in the first wave at the Battle of the Citadel. We saw Sovereign firsthand. <laughs> Cold shiver. You left the Alliance. Why did you leave the Perugia? After you died, Anderson lost political clout. The Council backslid on the Reaper menace. They discounted Sovereign as an isolated threat. As a single... Which was bullshit. 
They said your warnings of a greater danger were mistaken or delusional. We lost respect for Alliance leadership. We need to fight the real enemy, and only Cerberus seemed to be doing that. Is it yeah, man? All of social media stuff is info in the info of the uh, Twitch account. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, I'll def I'll definitely be looking at that. Uh, Gabby joining Cerberus. How did you end up with Cerberus, Gabby? Kenneth and I have been partners in crime since we graduated from Tech Academy. When he got the Cerberus offer, I insisted that it include me. He'd fall apart without me. Thanks, Mum. Also, I love Edmonds, <laughs> and the Normandy is state of the art. When I got the opportunity to work on her, I had to jump. Uh, Ken joining Cerberus. So how did you get an offer to join Cerberus, Ken? Once you were gone, the Alliance brass descended like vultures, tearing apart everything you'd said. I was very public with my defense for you. I didn't hold back. That's an understatement. If Kenneth wasn't such a talented engineer, they'd have court-martialed him for insubordination. But it got me noticed by the elusive man. He made an offer, and here I am. Hmm. Here we are. Well do, Commander. I'm amazed Shepard came down to see us. I told you he would. Yeah, man. All right, we'll go back up and we'll do some <laughs> missions. That was fun, but I'm going to have to pause it there. If you like this video, then please comment, subscribe, like, and of course share this video on your favorite social network. And if you'd like to see any other games that I've played, you can check out my playlist to see my other Let's Plays. If you'd like to see me play live, follow me on Twitch and you'll get notified whenever I play. That is it for this episode, and I will see you in the next game. Play Dead Inside. Oh man. Oh god! Oh god, run for your life! Holy shit! Holy fuck that! Oh my god, that really scared me! Holy shit, man.